Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will take you through the ES Unic Parallel Connection Installation and Configuration. This is the typical wiring diagram of ES Unic Parallel System. Include ES Unic, Goodwe Battery, Battery Bus Bar, Breaker, etc. Installation. We are using Goodwe Single Phase Inverter ES Unic and Lynx UG3 batteries. ES Unic only supports paralleling in the same power band. Goodwe Lynx UG3 series supports up to 30 units in parallel. One unit is used as an example in the video. First we hooked up two ES Unic. We prepare four cables and make DC terminals. Connect the DC cables to each of the two ES Unics. Need to prepare three sets of battery cables and make terminals. Connect the cable to the inverter port. Then snap on the protective cover. The other inverter is connected with two additional cables. Next we will use the combiner box. This is the inside of a combiner box. Upper connection inverter and lower connection battery. Perimeter holes for securing the combiner box. Thread the cable through the top and secure. The battery cables of the other inverter are also fixed in the combiner box. Take out the other two battery cables. One end of the cable is mounted on the bottom of the combiner box and the other end is mounted on the battery side. Prepare two network cables. Connect one end of the network cable to the combiner box. The other end is connected to the main inverter. The other network cable is connected to the combiner box and battery respectively. Install the protective cover on the network cable as shown in the video. Next we put the battery cover back on. Next, we'll connect the ground wire. Push the battery switch to on. Finally install the plastic cover on top of the battery. Next both inverters need to be connected to the AC side cable. It is then secured with a protective case. Prepare another network cable. One end is connected to the master and the other end to the slave. Take out the two-pin terminal and mount it on the CT. Mounting the terminals on the master inverter. The protective cover is then put back on. Take out the EaseLink 3000. Mounting the EaseLink 3000 to the inverter. Turn on the switch. Module light is on. The number of parallel inverter will be displayed on the screen. Configuration via Solargo. First we open Solargo. Select the Bluetooth connection method and refresh. Connection to the corresponding signal. When the connection is successful, it will automatically jump to the main page. Click Settings. Click Quick Settings. Enter the password Goodly2010. Selecting the number of inverters to be connected in parallel. Select the corresponding battery for connection. Confirm reboot for configuration to take effect. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe Training Series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.